Welcome to Zero Trend Edits. We're going to show you how to edit video in InShot. It's a regular app that uh, everybody uses to edit videos. It works pretty well. First, we're going to start with a new video project. Select a couple clips. Add them to our timeline. Now, from here, you can make any edits you want to make text, filters, add music. And here we go. We've got all of our clips in line. Now we can add some text if we want. Just by clicking text. Just type close. This is just a test. Just an example. Now we can place the text anywhere on the screen we want. And now as far as saving, we can change the resolution. Go 480p, 720p, 1080p, 4K, and frames, we can go 24 frames, 25 frames, 30 frames, 50 frames per second, or 60 frames per second. And we can save under movie or mp4 quality. I suggest you save under mp4 to save space on your hard drive on your phone. And after we select all that, we're going to put save. Now while that's saving, I'd like to ask you to click like and subscribe and add a comment. You can come back here for more commentaries or help on other editing software. This program saves pretty fast. Just depends how much space you have on your hard drive for the cache to use. About halfway. I'm just gonna save this clip into your photos. gets there we're gonna verify that it put in our photos and once it's saved you can share it to Instagram X telegram email Facebook or YouTube and it's that simple there you go. Next, we'll talk about photos. All right, next up, we're gonna edit photos. Click photo, click a photo you wanna edit. And from here, you can add filters, crop your images, straighten your image out. Basic photo software. For this video, we're just gonna crop it real quick. First, you can just crop. You can add the tilt, straighten everything out so everything is looking straight. Crop it down, hit the check mark. There you go. Next, you can save it to your camera roll, or you can add filters or text. Let's add some text to it real quick. Head pull. Text. We're going to move it to the top. And we're going to change the color so we can see it on the white background. Now in this particular app, you pretty much have to pay for everything. The fonts, everything else. But it's not bad. It's not a bad price. Anyway, the fonts are add-ons. So you kind of want to want to watch it with those add-ons. Now you can save it, and share it to your Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, all your internet stuff. You can save it to your X, P, 
case you want to show it to all your mean racist friends, you can show you know, your racist pictures on your age. Anyway, the next step we're going to show you how to edit a photo collage. First you're going to select some images you want in a collage. We're going to do a couple of Da Vinci's here. Next you can resize them or rearrange them. We can resize them here. so they fit differently, so the colors match if you want. And then I'll show you how you can rotate them or edit the filter on them. Let's see, first we'll start with a rotate. Just open the, click on the rotate button. As you can see, you can turn it in the direction you want. We're gonna turn it back. Next, we're going to use a filter to sort of match all the colors. So we're going to click down here on filters. First, we're going to turn the Bob Marley Ganja. No, that won't work. And then we're going with the. Let's see here. Let's try to get the colors to be more rich, as they say. There you go. Boom. Dark, rich, like coffee. Your image is the way you want it. You can save it. You can share it all over the internet with all your internet people. Facebooks, emails, your Instagrams, all that good stuff. There you go. Don't forget to click like and subscribe. This is Zero Trend Edits out.